I said it before, I've been saying it many times recently. The first thing a cult leader turns to tell you everyone's lying except for the cult. And the cult leader. But everyone, everyone's lying. Except for the things that they choose, their favourites. Donald Trump's favourite news channel was always Fox News. And he would more or less tell you everyone else is lying. Right? And yeah, th th there is a lot of garbage in the news media out there. Trump's raised the awareness of that in a very emotional way rather than an analytical way of pulling things apart. And the emotional way says, yeah, they're all lying. The analytical way says they're very biased. They lean towards their own political agenda views. They interpret things via that that might not necessarily relate or comport with what is really going on. Uh, they're lazy uh, because they made so much money. They don't have to try so hard anymore. They're lazy in their analysis of things. Thinking about the situation helps you understand that you could pull bits of information out of these new seeds and do your own data gathering and come to your own conclusions in better it may be ultimately in harder work than that they've even done. Of course, you wouldn't have a big studio or anything that's that they work hard. They work harder on effects and delivery and studio, good sound and, and video and all that than they do on the research on the storyline. But to quote Trump now, there's um, his his language now just because he doesn't like Fox News anymore. He's completely flipped with the viewpoint on its head. He's inverted it. All news feeds now are okay, except for Fox News. He's betrayed. He's an emotional uh, shitbag all over again. He's being emotional because he didn't get his way. And, of course, Fox News, in his view, have made him look like a buffoon. It's not very difficult to do that um, because he was always rooting for Fox News because it was his favourite, right? But now his followers, his, his, he's telling his followers, he's telling his cult, and it doesn't mean everyone that goes to his rallies is a member of the his cult but he's a he is a cult leader and telling them no longer to get their news to get their information from Fox News at all uh, he claiming that then that network is in fact unwatchable and they need to move uh, onto other platforms like I think he mentioned Newsmax and or well, the one America and he also said in his rant so he, he was saying oh, Fox is unwatchable uh, virtually unwatchable right and so moving forward he's also saying or any you know watch or any other news media His words. So Fox is virtually unwatchable, especially during the weekends. He said, I've "Got it in front of me." Uh, watch, own, or news, Max, or almost anything else is his words. So all this time, all these followers saying, oh, you watch too much news, you, you watch too much media. You're only saying it because Trump told you not to watch too much news, not too much media. Now he's telling to you to watch them all, except for Fox News. Rewind this video a little bit. Go back 
and hear me talk about how you critically analyze the information. The attitude from people who suck up to uh, like an echo chamber or Trump is an attitude from those who are so lazy in their thinking they uh, expect all news media to be the gospel truth and just sit and watch a, watch a program while being programmed and say oh that's the truth then echo chamber that as well it's lazy it's unprofessional it doesn't encourage critical thinking it doesn't cr encourage analytical analysis of information that is highly important particularly if it's a so-called news but it's not news anymore it's entertainment this has been your critical analysis of what the fuck is going on with that cult-like mentality well, definitely this is my news feed on the Aaron's approach there. <laughs> is it true? Does it hold any water? I think it does. I mean, how do you go from all all the news media are lying? They're all lying to oh, it's only Fox lying. Do you watch them all except for Fox? He's only doing that out of tantrum. He just feels betrayed, man. His favourite news scenes. So, so out of revenge, is he all go and watch the others and repeat what they're saying? Fox won't like it. It's just an emotional shit bag. Be why? Because his narcissistic fantasy of him being superior has been under threat. This is what a narcissist does. Facts don't matter. Truth doesn't matter. What matters to a narcissistic individual like that is to just build, big themselves up, and it doesn't matter if it contradicts what they said before. They don't matter. They don't care about contradictions. They care about what bigs them up in that moment and how they can ma manipulate their followers to buy their bullshit. In a nutshell, I think, so to speak. Peace out, thanks for watching, take care, and I'll look forward to doing another video soon. Tell me if I'm wrong as well. And by the way, give me some data to back up your claim.